Mahatma Gandhi, the father of Indian independence and champion of nonviolence. Mahatma Gandhi, a name synonymous with nonviolence, civil disobedience, and the struggle for freedom, remains one of the most revered figures in the annals of history. Born on October 2, 1869, in Porbandar, India, he transformed the course of world history through his unwavering commitment to truth, justice, and the pursuit of liberty. In this comprehensive exploration, we delve into the life and legacy of Mahatma Gandhi. From his early years in India to his pivotal role in the fight for Indian independence and his profound impact on the global civil rights movement, Gandhi's journey is one of remarkable courage, sacrifice, and moral leadership. Early Life and Education Gandhi's Childhood and Family Background Mohandas Karamchand Gandhi was born into a devout Hindu family in Porbandar, a coastal town in Gujarat, India. His father, Karamchand Gandhi, served as the Dewan, Prime Minister, of Porbandar, and his mother, Putlabai, was deeply religious and influenced Gandhi's early moral upbringing. Education in India and Abroad Gandhi's early education was grounded in traditional Hinduism and Jainism. He later pursued law in London, where he encountered Western philosophies and political thought that would shape his future activism. Early Experiences in South Africa Gandhi's journey into activism began in South Africa, where he moved to practice law. His experiences with racial discrimination and injustice in South Africa ignited his passion for civil rights and laid the foundation for his commitment to nonviolent resistance. Gandhi's Awakening to Social Injustice In South Africa, Gandhi experienced firsthand the racial prejudices of the time, including discriminatory laws against Indians and other non-European communities. These experiences fueled his desire to fight for justice and equality. Civil Rights Activism in South Africa Gandhi's initial involvement in civil rights activism included leading campaigns against the disenfranchisement of Indians in South Africa. His efforts led to the successful repeal of discriminatory laws and earned him the title of Mahatma, Great Soul. The Birth of Satyagraha, Truth Force During his time in South Africa, Gandhi developed the concept of Satyagraha, which he described as the pursuit of truth and justice through nonviolent resistance. This philosophy would become the cornerstone of his future activism in India. The Fight for Indian Independence Gandhi returned to India in 1915, eager to apply the principles of Satyagraha to the struggle for Indian independence from British colonial rule. He quickly rose to prominence as a leader in the Indian National Congress. Leadership in the Indian National Congress Gandhi's leadership and ability to mobilize mass movements made him a prominent figure in the Indian National Congress. His methods of civil disobedience and non-cooperation became powerful tools in the fight for independence. Salt March and Civil Disobedience One of Gandhi's most iconic acts of civil disobedience was the Salt March in 1930. He led a 240-mile march to the Arabian Sea to protest the British monopoly on salt production, galvanizing the nation and drawing international attention. Principles of Satyagraha and Nonviolence the philosophy of truth and nonviolence. Gandhi's philosophy of Satyagraha was grounded in the pursuit of truth and nonviolence. He believed that truth could only be achieved through nonviolent resistance to oppression and injustice. Satyagraha as a force for change. Gandhi's campaigns, including the Salt March and various boycotts, demonstrated the effectiveness of Satyagraha in challenging oppressive regimes. His willingness to endure suffering and imprisonment inspired millions. The influence of Jainism and Tolstoy. Gandhi's principles were influenced by Jainism's concept of nonviolence, ahimsa, and Leo Tolstoy's writings on Christian pacifism. These influences helped shape his commitment to nonviolent action. Gandhi's impact on Indian independence. The Quit India Movement. Gandhi played a central role in the Quit India movement of 1942, a mass protest demanding an end to British rule in India. 
The movement led to widespread arrests and intensified international pressure on the British. Negotiations with the British As India's struggle for independence gained momentum, negotiations with the British became crucial. Gandhi participated in discussions that eventually led to India's independence in 1947. Independence and Partition On August 15, 1947, India achieved independence, and the Indian Independence Act of 1947 resulted in the partition of India into two separate nations, India and Pakistan. Gandhi vehemently opposed the partition and worked tirelessly to promote harmony between Hindus and Muslims. Gandhi's Legacy in India Communal Harmony and Reconciliation Gandhi's commitment to communal harmony and interfaith dialogue remains an enduring legacy in India. His efforts to bridge religious divides continue to inspire peace initiatives. Gandhi's Global Influence The American Civil Rights Movement Gandhi's philosophy of nonviolence and civil disobedience profoundly influenced civil rights leaders like Martin Luther King Jr. King credited Gandhi's ideas as a major inspiration for the American civil rights movement. Assassination and Mourning The Tragic End of Mahatma Gandhi On January 30, 1948, Mahatma Gandhi was assassinated by a Hindu nationalist who opposed his views on religious tolerance and the partition. His death was a profound loss to the world. Mahatma Gandhi's life and legacy are a testament to the power of moral courage, compassion, and unwavering dedication to the principles of truth and nonviolence. He remains a guiding light for those who seek to create positive change in the world. As we conclude this comprehensive exploration of Mahatma Gandhi, we recognize that his legacy transcends borders and generations, serving as a reminder of the enduring impact one individual can have on the course of history.